this video I'm going to show you how to use the developer console and uh, to debug your CSS and uh, JavaScript now of course I these are <laughs> entirely huge uh, coding languages so I cannot explain them so I'll just show you how you can um, take advantage of the Chrome's um, inspect uh, console so for any element you would like to inspect simply right click and click on inspect element now you can see here the DOM of the page and on to the right the CSS uh, properties and styles attached to that sp specific um, tag so for example we here we have an h2 and an h4 and you, if you're familiar with uh, CSS you can add as many type, uh, CSS properties here as you want to test how it looks like and of course to customize in your uh, in your uh, website so for example if I add font size 64 as you can see it has instantly changed and it's a good thing if you want to debug problems or CSS debug problems is very too easy to do it with the CSS now great thing is also you can locate specific uh, styles so if you look here we have the templates.css and after the double column right here you can see the line where this style is uh, added onto the uh, 1027 now I highly discourage you to edit the template.css because it will be, it will auto most likely be uh, updated so any change you add here as rules styles and so on they will be overwritten into the next uh, theme update so instead just install a child theme and edit the style.css in that child theme with uh, the WordPress editor I already have uh, the Kalias team, uh, Kalias child team, right here. It's activated, and if I want to add custom styles, I just go to the editor. I make sure Kalias child team is selected, and um, edit the style.css with the styles that I want. So uh, this is how you can use on the CSS side it's like I said easier to uh, use the console but most importantly if you have for example um, if you have uh, JavaScript errors there's most likely going to uh, be the page will break somehow it won't work it will cause problems so you can see here if uh, for example this is just an error if uh, which says that uh, failed to load a resource and by that resource it means a style sheet right here so it's not actually a, a sorry a JavaScript um, error now let me just provoke an error right here into the console if as you can see unknown syntax error uh, because there was something missing this is a uh, the debugger of uh, the Kalias uh, Kal uh, sorry the Chrome uh, consoles uh, debugger yeah so if you see errors like this which are related to the JavaScript um, it would be better if you can point us these errors if you are having trouble with them and post them onto our uh, forums so there's actually there are actually tons of uh, tutorials on Google if you search for how to use the developer console in Chrome 
you will see a lot of resources tutorials and so on and remember it's a very very powerful tool I mean I don't think I would have I would survive in this uh, in these ages without it it even has a, a device um, simulator for example Apple uh, iPhone 6 and I can as you can see I can replicate the uh, iPhone 6 right here I can also make it bigger and most importantly it will simulate the taps not the clicks so it's a very powerful uh, uh, it's a very powerful tool and I highly recommend uh, if you're planning to get more into this um, development uh, environment you can uh, learn more about it I won't jump into these ones because are there they're very complex and it would takes uh, it would take hours to do this and you won't probably need them so much so this is it uh, thanks for watching and uh, if you have any questions or suggestions or what to record in the future feel free to share with us and if you have troubles of course subscribe to our support forums and my colleagues will uh, will try to uh, assist you so again thanks for watching and see you in the next one